Let's switch up. You take the next one. All right. Sounds good. Jehovah's Witnesses are fundamentalists who have an uncompromising faith. The largest question in our world today is whether people of uncompromising faith are going to destroy the other or embrace the other. Whether people of uncompromising faith are going to see it is imperative to act out with violence toward the other or to act out with decency and dignity toward the other. So the question of our world may not be whether we're going to have fundamentalism or whether fundamentalism is bad, but what type of fundamentalism we're going to have. America needs a tidal wave of the old-time religion. America the media has always liked to focus on fundamentalists who are either ridiculous I have sinned against you, my lord. Or dangerous. For the children say, you might have to bear a gun. The Bible says that there is a way which seems right, but the end thereof are the ways of death. I'm certainly afraid of extremists who want to take away my rights or threaten our democracy. But the Bible's very clear how God loves people and how he feels. Yet Jehovah's Witnesses practice a different kind of fundamentalism. Their door to door message may be annoying, but their uncompromising faith hasn't hurt our freedom. In some surprising ways, it's actually helped define it. The importance of the Bible and how it can help us with our daily life. Between 1935 and 1958, the Jehovah's Witnesses were in the Supreme Court a remarkable 45 times. Uh, and there are periods during uh, First Amendment history when you see a particular group really carrying the banner of free expression. You could say that they don't fight, you could say that they don't vote, but what they have done is litigate. And in a way, they've contributed more uh, to American democracy and the protection of American ideals than a lot of people have with their votes. Jehovah's Witnesses stood up for their own religious freedom. Even if their intention was not to help other groups, the impact shifted the court's focus to protecting the unpopular and expanding rights for everyone. The right to speak freely on street corners and door to door to publish an unconventional message without getting arrested, the right to be a conscientious objector of war, and the right of all patients seeking medical treatment to control what's done to their bodies.